Now, now it's time for Jared and Katie's War of the Roses call on 107.5 KZL, the number one hit music station. Jared, Katie, Jason, and Man Kisser Matt. Hey guys, I'm a big time AML and hate that I'm emailing you for the first time because I think my wife Tara is cheating on me. Oh man. We've been married for four years now and every year we take the last two weeks of December off leading into the new year. We've been planning on doing that this year when my wife informed me that she had to work to finish a project for the upcoming year during that time. So she would leave at her normal time in the morning, but would come home later and later and later as the days went on. I got suspicious and went up to her work and her car wasn't there. When I asked her if she left work at all during the day, she said no. Ooh. Something isn't right here. Can we please do a War of the Roses call on her? Thank you, Wayne. We live in Pilot Mountain. And we do have Wayne on the phone. Good morning, Wayne. Hey, Wayne. Hey, good morning. Hey, good morning. So your wife uh, said she had to work, but you're thinking that maybe she wasn't at work? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that's about it. When um, you, hey, can I ask you, when you asked your wife if she left, did she get really weird about it, or did she just flat out say, nope, been there all day? <sighs> you know, it's sort of a combination. I, I, the truth is we've always gone on vacation, so I just thought it was strange that she couldn't go this year anyway. I mean, we, we know that for the whole year leading up to it, but so... I mean, I just thought that was odd to begin with, basically. But, you know, I asked her how work's going, and she always says it's going well, but she's really busy. She's got this big project she's trying to finish and stuff. So, I mean, yeah, I, I feel like she's lying. And if she is, she's doing it, you know, straight to my face. Okay. Um, well, maybe the car wasn't in the same parking lot as it usually is in. Maybe there was a parking change. It, the parking lot's not that big. I mean, no, it's, I mean, and I'm guessing a big high-rise or anything. Okay. That time of year, too, is probably not a lot of mm-hmm. people there. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Um, yeah, it's kind of ghost town around here the last week or two sometimes. All right, well, do you still want to do the call? Yeah, please. I mean, if you guys can help me out, I'd appreciate it. I, mean, I hate that I'm doing this, but, you know, I feel like she's lying to me. If she can get the truth out of her, then then that would be really great. Okay. All right, we hope for you that it's just she was working. All right, hold on one second. Yeah, me too. Hello? Yeah, may I speak to Tara? Uh, this is she. Hi, Tara. This is Jeff with Well, how are you? I'm good. How are you doing? We're doing good. We starting a we just started a brand new promotion here at and we were picking names at random to give away a free one week vacation for two to anywhere in the continental US. And your name came up and we want to offer oh that. Oh my god. Yeah, congratulations. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's amazing. I just had two weeks off of work. This is amazing. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah? You just had two weeks off of work? Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, great. What? Tara? You had two weeks off from work? Uh, this is what? Wayne. Excuse me? This is Wayne, Tara. You're, you had two weeks off of work? Really? That's, uh, you had two I weeks mean, off? Well, I, no, that's not I, what you've been I telling me. I didn't have two weeks off of work, but I, w- I should have had two weeks off of work, but I didn't. Um, no, 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 You just said you had two weeks off work, and you were really excited about taking two people. Are you, uh, is that other person me? What have you been doing for two weeks, Tara? Um, no, I was at work. I was totally at work, and you know that. I, I, and what, what is going on also that you are on the phone with me? Well, clearly, I, I called these guys to see if they could help me out because I felt like you were lying to me. You've been saying you've been going to work for two weeks, and uh, I didn't believe you. Quite honestly, I didn't believe you. And I went to your work, by the way, and I looked for your car, it wasn't there. What are you What are you talking about? And of course, I was at work. I was absolutely at work. You knew that I had this huge project for one of our top clients, and I was absolutely at work. Yeah, that's what and you've why, been saying. Why, uh, are you ca- why are you been... calling these other people to talk about this? You're lying, Tara. You're lying. Wayne, you, uh, you want me to call? What is it? Should I call your boss? Is that would that? And you know just, that I was let's at work. Let's clear that up. I'll just call the fight. boss, and and then he can tell me if, if you've been at work or not. Well, um, yeah? we did have, you know, we did have. This is Jared and Katie from Jared and Katie in the Morning, Tara on 107.5 KZL. And we do have the boss's phone number. We asked for that ahead of time. And if you want, we can can call call the boss. We'll clear it up right now. If you're at work, your boss would know, right? Hello? Tara? Right, Tara? Is she there? Tara, are you there? Are you there? Do we? Wayne? Tara. Can you hear us? 
I can hear you guys. She's gone. Is she gone? No, she's there. Tara, can you hear us? Tara. She's so busted. Okay, hold on. She's so busted. Oh, I'm here. I'm here. Can you, I can hear it. Oh, she's dead. There. Tara, you, can you hear me? Yeah, Tara. Are you there? Let's clear this up. If you say you're at work, we can just call your boss. We have the number. Just call your boss real quick, and yeah. he can say, all right, so we... Go we, right ahead. You can, uh, he'll tell you the truth. Call right now, Jerry. Go right, all right ahead. All right. I'm, we're going to call right now, okay? Yes, he'll tell you exactly what I'm telling you now. Okay, wait, 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 uh... Oh, yeah. We need to. We need to talk, but we can't, we can't talk on. I I need to talk to you, but let's not. Please don't call my boss. Wait, hold on. We got the number. You said. Have, have you been with the boss? Is, is that who you've been with the okay, last two please, weeks? Please, can you guys just please stop? Can you? I. You don't want to. You don't want to call. I don't want to talk to you on the air. You don't want to call your boss. You're please don't to, call my boss. She says no. Please, you gotta, it, okay. Can you please not call my boss. Okay. Uh, what, Why well, not? Why? You just, you just said all confident. Now you don't want us to. That's. Yeah, Tara. What's going on? I, I I can't talk to you. I can't talk to you like this. I let's out. We can we can talk later. I'm I can't talk to you. So I you, want to know what's going so on. So you don't want us to call the boss. Is she there? Tara. She hung up. Yeah, she's gone. What is going on? Boy, that went from oh I thought I thought you're in the clear to not in the clear uh-huh. anymore. Did she hang up? Yeah, she hung up. Yeah. So she We're sounded even more a little shaky. Yeah, she did. Huh. Okay. So does this okay. recon? I mean, I guess you got to talk to her one on one, but I think you know we called her bluff with calling the boss, and she was all about it, and then she said no. I mean, I want to know what she mm-hmm. has to say off the air to you. Like, can, <laughs> yeah, yeah, me too. Can you call um, us back? Because she doesn't say anything. She just said I can't talk. Yeah. Um. I don't know. I'm starting to think. Maybe it's the boss. I mean, she seemed to be all confident at first, and then, you know, maybe, I don't know. Well, if that's the case, the she's calling the boss now. Yeah, she's uh, covering it. Well, uh, yeah, she's trying to, like, you know, confirm the story and get their story straight and stuff. And Yeah. Yeah, I, I well, don't know. Let us know Let us know what you think, or let us know what happened, if we can follow up with you. Is that cool? Yeah, yeah, of course. I, I appreciate you guys, you know, doing this, because it, clearly she's lying. All right, and, well... Um, well, if you're able to find out anything today, if you can call us back tomorrow, if you can, um, give us an update. Has there been suspicion about the boss? Uh, I mean, I, I know they're close. I mean, in the, to the extent that they, you know, she she got a promotion pretty quickly early on. And I mean, that, that sort of makes a little more sense now. We sort of wondered why. And, and I, don't, I don't know. I mean, yeah, a little bit. Yeah, now that I'm thinking about it. Yeah. So. Wow. Okay. Well, uh, best of luck. Okay. Thank you. Um, thanks, you guys. I, I appreciate you um, helping me out. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. If you would like Jared and Katie to do one of their War of the Roses calls for you, simply email katie at 1075kzl.com.